tree that's broken and fallen over. See? And now it's in our way! Or maybe we can lift it. I don't think oh. you'll lift that. Huh? It's far too heavy. Huh? Who said that? We did. We are beetles. <laughs> this is our home. We live here with all our insect friends. We eat away at this log. We break it down into small bits. So it's food for the soil. And trees to help things grow. Interesting. This is Weta. Hello. Kia ora. This is Cockroach. Kia ora. Hello. And these are our giraffe weevil friends. Kia ora. Hello. I have this brand new camera. And we're off on an adventure to take photos. We don't want to disturb your home, but we would like to get past it. We can't go under it. We can't go through it. We'll have to go over it with a bridge. bridge with the trike, it wobbles. We need to find a way to keep the bridge still so it doesn't move. Like my camera tripod. See, it keeps the camera still because it has three legs. Three legs? Hmm. I wonder if that's the answer. You're on the right track, young newt. There's a way of building things like bridges so they don't move. May I show you? Here's a bridge. Look at the shapes on each side. And here's another bridge. Can you see the same shapes underneath it? Yes, they are all triangles. You're right, Darwin. They all have triangles in them. You can see the triangles here 
And the triangles here. Yes, I can see them. Triangles have three sides and make things you build stronger. Kia Thank you, Wapiti! I'm going to make our bridge strong. They all have that is the same. All insects have six legs. A beetle has six legs. A weta has six legs. A cockroach has six legs. Each giraffe weevil has six legs. They all do. That's exactly right, Darwin. Every insect has six legs. Live here. That looks great, Darwin. No one will disturb our insect friend's home now. Me, Hado! Awesome! <laughs> 